Fred Herbelsheimer was born on July 4, 1921 in Wakefield, Massachusetts. He attended the University of Maine, receiving his Bachelor and Master of Science degrees in 1943 and 1948, respectively, the latter following three years of service in the Army, including the 76th Infantry Division in Europe. He joined his father at the university in later years to serve as speaker for the school's pulp and paper fundraising meeting. Fred joined Tilmany Pulp and Paper Company in 1957. He is shown here attending the company's production meeting. From 1971 until 1986, he served as president. Fred was responsible for the development of new paper machines. Number 13 paper machine, added in 1963, featured a reverse suction pickup at the wet end. This machine was the first of its kind in the specialty paper market and allowed increased machine speeds, additional capacity, and reduced operating costs. This development sparked the firm's growth in the specialty grades. Paper machine number 15 used water that had already been used in the pulping process and led to the firm's entry into the lightweight craft and one-time carbonizing markets. Fred even found time to evaluate paper made on a smaller scale by his son Eric. In 1967, Fred visited Finland for a consulting project. Fred had time to take in views of the surrounding architecture. He focused on environmental initiatives, leading Tilmany and area papermakers in efforts to comply with tough new environmental standards to clean up the Fox River during the 1970s and 1980s. A few of his projects included a state-of-the-art wastewater treatment plant and a program to reduce air pollution. As a youngster, Fred studied in a program at the George Stone School of Percussion in Boston. He just stopped playing a few years ago but worked many saloons around Appleton, Wisconsin in his younger days. Fred also counts hunting among his hobbies. He frequently went trap or skeet shooting with some of the guys at Tilmany and even found time for pheasant hunting in Wisconsin. Fred's first wife, Phyllis, passed away in 1999. Their children are a daughter, Karen Hole, and a son, Eric. Fred and his current wife, Janet Rood, reside in Shelbourne, Vermont.